This contest set for one fall is to determine the challenger for WWE Champion Alberto Del Rio at Night of Champions. Introducing first, from Chicago, Illinois, weighing 222 pounds, C.M. Punk. King, will see a Punk be completely focused here tonight following what happened earlier when he was cheap-shotted, punched in the skull by Kevin Nash? Well, you know what? I don't know how this man can stay focused. He has been the center of controversy since he won his half of the WWE Championship. His opponent from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing 240 pounds, pounds, John C. Great. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the night began to go with to work. Cena demanding their rematch for the WWE title. C.O. Triple H decided to settle this in a one-on-one -on -one match to see who earns the first opportunity to face Del Rio. Well, we saw these guys light it on fire in Chicago at Money in the Bank. But then again, at SummerSlam. And tonight, the stakes are even higher. Tonight of champions to meet Alberto Del Rio for the WWE title. Uh, who knows, but what an amazing atmosphere here tonight on Monday Night Raw. I can't help but wonder which man Alberto Del Rio would like to face at Night of Champions, John Cena or CM Punk. for control. Last week on Raw, we saw Alberto Del Rio brutally attack Rey Mysterio after their one-on-one -on -one matchup. Yeah, and that's right. And as a result of Del Rio's dastardly attack, Mysterio now needs surgery. And with Mysterio out of action, Del Rio is now claiming to be the new Latin hero for the WWE Universe. Oh my gosh, that's laughable. He can't anoint himself a hero. The WWE Universe determines who the real heroes in the ring are. And hopefully, whoever wins this matchup here tonight can shut Del Rio up once and for all at Night of Champions. Tie up. This is about skill and power. Into the headlock. John Cena making a move. And here's John Cena. Seen has been WWE champion an amazing nine times, and yet he's approaching this contest like it's his very first opportunity at the gold. Nine times? Alberto Del Rio hasn't even been champion for nine days, and I'm already sick of it. Well, typical response from the WWE Universe for John Cena here tonight. You know, no superstar in history draws the emotion out of the WWE Universe like John Cena. He's so polarizing. Yeah, but you know, there's one thing you have to remember when listening to this one particular crowd. We are in Bizarro Land tonight. Yeah, it's Canada. <laughs> Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? Quick thinking to avoid that. Oh, John 
Cena's no slouch when it comes to his ground game. Ouch! Oh, going to the top, high risk! Earlier tonight, we caught a glimpse of exactly how dangerous Alberto Del Rio really is when he made John Morrison tap out using his patented cross arm breaker. Yeah, but did he have to put it on Morrison again after the match? I think it's just a matter of frustration, King. Remember, CM Punk and John Cena came out here and essentially called Del Rio an afterthought. Well, that still doesn't justify his actions. The match was over. He won. Just act like a champion and go to the back. He's heading back up. No! Wow. How good is this guy? Nice reversal there. Oh, man! And he collapses down to the canvas. Alberto Del Rio wasted no time cashing in his Money in the Bank contract at SummerSlam. He only had the briefcase for less than a month. You know, the only superstars that have cashed it in sooner have been Jack Swagger, Edge, and remember Kane. He cashed it in on the same night that he won it. Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. One. Two. Of course, nobody can forget the mistake by guest referee Triple H in the SummerSlam Three. matchup that cost John Cena the WWE Championship. Yeah, but you know what? To his credit, Cena didn't cry about Triple H missing his foot on the rope at SummerSlam. Oh, oh. look at this! Look at this! Cena went for the AA! And Punk elbows to the jaw! Fighting out of it! And he continues those elbows to... to Cena's jaw! And Cena's reeling now! Yes! Punk with a big knee to the face! Cover, hooks the leg. Oh my gosh, this could be it for Cena. Sidesteps that one. Yeah, just when you think you have Punk right where you want him. He hits a sweet combination. I can't imagine what Triple H must be going through right now as he heads to the medical facility to be with his friend Kevin Nash, who John Laurinaitis tells us was just in an automobile accident. Triple H and Kevin Nash have been friends for 15 years. It must be an extremely difficult situation, King. He was one step ahead on that one. He gets out of trouble there. can say all you want to about CM Punk, but in my book, he's just not that good. What? Are you serious? Do you realize Punk has beaten Cena on two different occasions over the past month and a half? Yeah, well, if he can do it again tonight, then I'll admit he's good. Oh, my. John Cena. Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. And there's the reversal. Whoa. And a huge collision with the barricade. Two. CM Punk has been the most big Three. impact into the guardrail. Boy, he was able to reverse and get out of that. He anticipated that move perfectly. And there's the elbow. Four. back in Six. I don't like how slow he is to react right now we're seven. up to seven. Oh man is he fired up Punk turns it around uh, Punk can change the outlook of a match in an instant Going to the top, high risk! He's having a serious... Look out, John Cena is measuring. I 
been an incredible match. And look at whoa, CM whoa, 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 Punk, Cena with the shoulders down. Could be in here, oh. and Cena stays alive. And a roundhouse kick from Punk. That may do it. Cena may be finished. Punk signaling, time to go to sleep. And Punk could be closing in on the championship. CM Punk could be closing in on the championship. Cena's out, King. No doubt about it. He's got a the GT. CM Punk! This isn't what? over yet! That's what Triple H had said. Oh, oh look, at look at this! The AA from Cena! Hook in the leg! Oh my god! And he got it! Cena wins it! Alberto Del Rio on the number one contender. Well, Del Rio trying to send a message to John Cena here tonight. Cena, I don't think he knows where he is, Ken. Oh, look out! Oh, oh, and right to the back of the man. head. A vicious attack by Del Rio. And it continues. Somebody's got to stop this. And speaking of somebody, look at this. Yeah, there's John Laurinaitis. Uh, he's in charge tonight. Remember, King, he was the one who, uh, who told Triple H Nash had been in a car accident. Triple H left the building, leaving Laurinaitis in charge tonight. Well, I think Laurinaitis lost control of this night a long time ago. He's lost control oh. again because look at Del Rio. Come on, Laurinaitis, get him off of there. Del Rio not having any of this. He is determined to destroy John Cena. Oh no, watch out, watch out! Oh my god! Laurinaitis has got to get some control over Alberto Del Rio. 